that's, that's the picture. Sure. It's a pretty diagram, diagrammatic. Um, and you're you know, welcome to what we're going to send in the illustrated files up to the stick of the PPS. But all these files are going to be in there. And can you, can you, uh, are, there, are these graphics uh, on the site, or can you? Um, before they have a chance to, like, clean up the road. That's kind of good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Figure out how to do that. Obviously, it needs to have openings and it needs to be staggered so that boats can the, the gymnasium and stuff to kind of divide some spaces and all the right. uh, Soil reinforcement and how uh, that was a cause that uh, buildings to carry uh, supplies for the Japan uh, effort. So basically, you register by location and you add to that location into sort of more of a building man festival. So general like landscaping, finding photos, jewelry, clothing, many important documents, and like the small fishing villages where the government's not going to spend tons of money making huge seawalls. I did a little research into it. Engineered structurally strong enough to survive an earthquake or a disaster. This rubble that it already sort of has a shape and a form and a color. From a brainstorming standpoint, or in a session like this, or. I think there's certain types of design challenges that it could be very applicable to. There's open source, crowdsourcing, things like that. Open source could definitely become a, a really uh, amazing framework to deliver design. Uh, we, we believe that, for instance, uh, the way that people are working is essentially changing. I think open source could potentially have a big impact on design, and it does have a place. Um, right now, uh, we're learning, you know, there are positives and negatives to, to open source. And I think being open to, to sharing them and, and letting them evolve with someone else's contribution is, is a very positive thing. I think that open source as a concept is great because it actually improves a lot faster. We are so accustomed to open source. Uh, we use all these programs. We're sitting all in the studio. And we're constantly presenting our ideas to each other and we learn from them. It's the, the best way is to collect as much ideas as possible from as many different minds and also you know, be able to comment on each other's, on each other's work. I, I think there is some relevance, uh, especially for problems that no one is, is taking on or is taking on in a really uh, valid or really new way. It's, I think design is relevant to a lot of different fields. Especially in, in the learning environment, the school environment, everything is built off critiques and um, outside um, input to improve your design. When we share ideas, um, we can get a lot more out of them than when we keep them to ourselves. So. I think opening those doors to the open source allows it to become bigger and more depth. So yeah, I think it's definitely needed <laughs> to say that. <laughs>